Welcome to My Sammy Tutorials. In this video, I will be introducing you to the My Resources module in My Sammy, where you can access and save community resources and or services to keep a historical record of agencies worked with or interested in. In this video, we're going to go over how to save, organize, and edit resources on the My Resources landing page, videos on how to search and interact with the service provider info page, as well as access and complete the attached intake form, will be linked in the description below. To begin, let's visit mysami.slco.org and log into our account. From here, we're going to click on My Resources, which is the middle module on the second row. To save resources, I'm going to quickly search for a service I need by clicking on Search Resources. Let's say I need case management support for housing and I am literally homeless. Once I find a service listing that I am interested in, I'm going to click on Save. I first heard about this resource today and within notes, I'm going to state that I've called and spoke to Jennifer for more information and will connect to Brad to begin the intake process. I also have the ability to send the saved resources as an email in the circumstance that my case manager had referred me to this source and I wanted to notify them that I actually looked this up. And I have the ability to upload a document if wanted. However, I'm not going to send this as an email at this time. Clicking on add will add this service to the My Resources landing page. Here, resources are organized by those I have saved and am interested in, resources accessed that I'm currently working with, resources completed that I have already worked with, and resources dropped that I have attempted to access and was ineligible for or started and couldn't complete at this time, like a GED readiness program. To edit the resource, click on the pencil button. Let's say I completed intake and will begin the program next week. Clicking on save will save the inputted information and reorganize the resources accordingly. Editing another service, clicking on reset will clear the inputted information and clicking on the arrow button in the top right corner will direct back to the previous page you were on. The location icon links to Google Maps and provides directions to the provider's office location. Clicking on the trash can will delete your selected service. A pop-up will appear to confirm deletion. If this was a mistake, click cancel. If not, click on delete. Near the top of the screen, the filter by allows you to search your saved resources by either service type or provider name. The resources below will filter out accordingly and to clear the search, just click on the blue X. For additional support, please contact the Human Services Navigator at 3546855555 or email us at navigator at slco.org. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day.